Alright guys, uh, we are back with another episode of Obana, and today we're going to be doing some redstone business, because we haven't done any on the server yet, and some of you may know redstone is my favorite part of Minecraft. I love redstone. If there was no redstone for me, there would be no Minecraft, because I would care less about it. Um, So, so let's play. Alright, so we're going to make some repeaters. Um, here we go. Take some of that, take some of that, and I think I don't have the stuff for it. Alright, so let's go. Wrong chest. Okay, let's get dust. Now let's see if we have the stuff for it. Alright. That there. That there. Out there. Um, there will be no comparators in this. Uh, to be honest, I don't even know how to use them. Let me sleep before I go out there, anyways. I don't, really don't even know how to use comparators, to be honest with you. Just never really tried or paid any attention. I mean, I kind of a little bit because I've watched Snake B and he uses them in his lava thing where he gets another brick and all that. But, um,. It's like nether brick and air at 3,000 or some shit. And I think I've lagged out. So, let me do this one time. Okay, and somebody is beating on my door. I think it's the baby. Alrighty. So, it's daytime. And I need some of them. Lots of coal, lots of coal. I don't need to get in this anyway. I didn't really need to use a crafting table for this, but it doesn't really matter. Swap with them too. Let me put my mob drops in here really quickly. I have so many bones. So, we're going to be doing lamp design out here. I have 45 lamps. So, I think we're going to do a checkerboard. Won't be very hard to wire either. If I do this design. some of these. Boom, boom. Can break that real quick. That's one thing I like about glowstone lamps, or redstone lamps, whatever you want to call them. You can break them without them turning into just glowstone dust. Which gets annoying if they turn into glowstone dust. Okay, yeah, I should have plenty to do this design. So let's just do the opposite of what we have on this side. Oops. I'm a little bit laggy as, um, not too bad. I like it's what I'm used to, but a little bit worse than I'm used to on Lavana, probably. Oh my goodness. Keep double placing. I don't know what I'm going to put on these grass spots. I'm probably going to go and find those fern things and shear them and put them there because I think that'll look nice with the lights on the sides of them too. The thing about bristol lamps though, they're so expensive. Good lord. It takes for a stack of glowstone, it takes four stacks of redstone to make a stack of redstone lamps. That's very expensive. Um, 
in case you guys didn't know or haven't made these before, which I haven't until now. <laughs> until now, I've never made a redstone lamp, which is pretty surprising. Okay. So, let's get right to this. Um... I'm digging out the wrong spot. Let me get this dirt. I don't need lamps anymore. Oops, wrong thing again. Fill this back in. So I'm going to place a block up under each of them at this level. Oops, not there. Okay. And I will be using a day-night sensor for this, so I don't have to power them my own way. Um, and I mean that would be cool if I could power them my own way too. I don't know. I don't think I'm going to do that. Okay, I think this is the end. Okay, I think this is the last one. Alright, so let's do that. That, that. That, that. That, that, and that. So I'm going to need a lot, 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 lot more repeaters than this. Um, so it probably means there's going to be a lot of cuts in this episode. So we're going to put repeaters in the in front of each of these blocks that I just placed. And I'm going to cut and go make lots of repeaters and lots of redstone torches. So I'll be right as I'm back and I got a lot more materials. Hopefully it'll be enough. So let's set up the rest of the repeaters. Uh, guys, this is probably some of the simplest redstone you'll ever do. Um, I'll ever do at least. Some guys never touch redstone in their whole Minecraft career. Some people, that's all they do. <laughs> Prince sees Etho. No, I'm just kidding, he does other things too, just not as often. Alright, so we're placing these torches here on every of these every one of these blocks that I place, which we'll be turning on these lamps, because it's giving them a redstone signal. Alright. Um Um and I'm gonna let you guys know about something. Um if you guys need any help with redstone, like basic redstone, stuff like that, go to um, Seth Bling's redstone tutorial. He was giving uh, one of the Mojang developers a redstone tutorial. Uh, he wasn't, uh, because of the 1.5 update, he wasn't too, um, he didn't know much about redstone, uh, so he's, he's explaining more of it to him. All right. So now this is the main part done. All right. Uh, so next we're gonna need blocks, which is gonna be the dirt, and we're gonna just jump up like this. That's all we're gonna do. All right. Um, so this block is gonna have a daylight sensor on it. Okay, so we're going to go back right back down here. Okay, that's where the redstone is too. Alright, so, 
this block. I'm pretty sure. Okay. I think that's right. And then, or maybe dust will work actually. Dust works for that too. I don't need um, one of those things for it. Alright. So. The daylight center is going to be on this block right here, which is going to power this dust, which will power all of these, hopefully. And should go all the way down here. I'm not positive about how far that is. Um, but for these also down here, I will need uh, to get a repeater to make the signal go further. I'm not going to do that set on camera because that'll get boring just repeating the same process over and over. Alright, so. Now, all we have to do is get the day and night sensor. Alright. Um, my way up is right there, and I can't take that way anymore. Alright. Okay, let's go up. Okay, I just... Serious right now. Alright. So... next thing we have to do is make a day-night sensor which to be honest with you I have no idea how to make so I might have to cut right here and figure out I know it has nether quartz and that's pretty much all I know so I'll see you then alright guys I'm back and uh, I figured out the recipe it's not that hard of a recipe actually it's just something I wouldn't expect it to be really uh, so it's this and then half slabs wooden half slabs at the bottom like that. I should have done a daylight sensor. Alright, so. I don't know, and I had to go borrow one quartz, one nether quartz, not the quartz block, but just one nether quartz from Dan. Um, Dan, I'm sorry if you don't have a problem with that. Uh, uh, but, I mean, if you do, I can go get you some more, or I know Tripper's got some too. So, alright, with this, um, once it turns to night, um, this will give off a signal and send it to the to the huh. Maybe I need to invert the signal. Let me go see what's going on down here. Creeper for one thing. That's nice. Okay, screw you. Okay, there's all kinds of mobs down here. Freaking screw you, dude. Come on, get off of me. God. That kind of sucks. It's the creeper and skeletons just waiting on me when I fall down. That really sucks. Not just kind of. Oh, God, that's so much work I have to do again. <laughs> Not really, but work I don't want to be doing <laughs> necessarily. Oh my goodness, God! The creeper did some damage. He was a buff creeper, obviously. Very, very strong one. Goodness. <sighs> Wow, wow, wow. He destroyed part of my redstone. Fuck creepers. Screw them. Okay, yeah, that's what it is. Uh, I need to invert the signal. So I'm actually need to move the day night sensor and this to I think here's okay. Actually. Okay, and then there's a torch right here. That should do it. Then I just need to run redstone. Put there. And then I can do... Once I get to here... 
I can just do this and then that and then wrap it around like this and then this should continue I'll do that so I'm going to fix this real quick if I can remember exactly how to do it just kidding I know exactly how to do it don't worry <sighs> don't necessarily want to do it though why does God just give us creepers why did Mojang give us creepers did we ask for creepers pretty sure nobody asked for creepers Surely we've asked for the opposite. Okay, let me get some more lamps because some of my lamps were just destroyed. Oh, yeah, this doesn't even need to be here. So it didn't destroy too much redstone, actually. Like I thought. Okay. And then we need more dust, but this redstone can just continue on to the other side. And I'll put a repeater right there so the signal actually goes through. And I'm going to need more repeaters, which is probably going to cost for more torches too. But at least we can see if this side will work correctly. I think that needs to have that on it. And then I need to figure out what block that is. I didn't know. Okay. Alright, so let me get out of here. I'll fix all this later, don't worry. I need to fix this right now so I can actually get through. God, why do creepers always have to bother me? Second episode in a row. I'm gonna use a pick on it. Okay, good, works. <laughs> All scared. Okay. So should I put this right here? Can I? Does that work? Okay, does that turn this off? Yes, it does. Sweet. Okay. And now at night, um, these should all turn on. And I will check that before the episode's over to make sure so I'm not giving you guys bad information. There we go. I made it. Alright, I have a stone brick I can place right there. And what goes here? Furnace. Um, I have a, uh, more furnaces up top too. Alright, so I'm going to get all this fixed off camera. And when it turns night, I'll take you guys outside to check if it works. And hopefully by then I'll have the other side done. If not, um, I'll finish it before next episode. So, we'll see you guys when, I, when it's night time. Alright guys, so it's all set up and working. As you can see, I did have to make a few changes, which I will show you right now. Um... What I realized was, is that these things don't fully power blocks, which I just fell on here, which is okay, actually. Okay, um, which means I had to put a repeater right next to it, and these will power during the day, which will turn all these repeaters on, which will cause all these torches to turn off, which will cause the lamps to also turn off.
which means the lamps will be off during the day. All right. I'm not sure how many blocks this is. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Okay, so it'll reach. All right, so I don't need this actually. I will need that though. And by next episode, I will have the other side done for you guys, and I will show you how it looks at night. And wow. Are you serious? Okay, I think I'm not really here. I think I've logged out. Hold on, let me get one second here, one second, one second. Hidden, haha, you guys don't have the IP. Okay, so it's all working correctly, um, I'll go sleep real quick so I can show you guys that it works for the daytime too. Alright, so I wonder if that'll work with a glass over it. I guess we'll see. Alright, so, glass right there, it'll make it look a lot better too, not just some random hole, hole. and I'll go sleep, so that, okay, so that I lag out, okay, let me lock back in really fast, wow, I'm right here, I still haven't even put the glass in, Okay, let me go back into my house, and go sleep. Alright, and hopefully the lights will be turned off. I did go and test this in creative a little bit, because uh, I was having a hard time with the daylight sensor, and wondering why I wasn't powering, and yep, it worked. Alright guys, so that's exactly what you have to do, that redstone. Um. And what I realized is you don't have to invert it. The, I mean, from the daylight sensor, you don't have to invert it because the redstone torches up under the lamps are automatic inverters, so that works. Um, yep, and that's pretty much it for today, guys. Um, thanks for watching. You'll see the full thing done next episode. Um, and you may have noticed these are like full windows. It's because I have Optifine now. Um, and it makes it where there's the windows look better, and it reduces lag, so, um, thanks for watching guys, I appreciate it, stay tuned for next episode, and I will be doing hopefully a little bit more redstone next episode, we'll find out though, see ya.